everybody it's holly here from hollywood beauty on instagram if you guys haven't checked me out over there make sure to check me out i post every single day about makeup beauty style and make sure to like and subscribe to me here on youtube i post every week with new beauty and style videos for you guys so today's video is going to be my specialty i like to call it my go-to gotta keep consistent gotta keep posting these because it's my favorite makeup brand to use basically i have so much other stuff so I'm going through my collection, wanting to review a whole bunch of it for you guys because I know people, you're out there probably looking for a review, figuring out what to buy. So I'm gonna do a review on KKW Beauty blushes. I don't have all of the blushes, but I have a lot of the blushes. I review my favorites for you, why I like them, what the colors look like, who I'd recommend them for, all that stuff I kind of talk about. So I have a, I have six blushes. So I'm gonna go through these and tell you a little bit about them. So I'll maybe go through and order from the first one I got to the last one I got. That's kind of fun. So I'm gonna start off with the first blush called Grace. It was one of their very original blushes. I wanted to try a blush because I love their powders. Like their eyeshadow palettes are my favorite on the planet, so I had to do it. So this color is almost like a, it's like a deep rose kind of color, which I like the color quite a bit, but I think because this was one of their first blushes, the formula isn't the best. Like it takes, it took me about three or four applications of that to get a solid color. As you can see, it's a beautiful color, but it is light on pigment. So if you prefer your blush that way, I think there's no downside to it, but I do like a little bit more pigment in my blush. So formula wise, I think this is just a starting point for them. It was one of their first blushes. So I'd say this is maybe my least favorite out of the bunch, but not color-wise, it's just formula-wise. And it was an original blush, so I'm sure they're different now. The next blush I got was Flower Wall. Love this blush. It's part of her bridal collection. It is a really beautiful light matte pink color. I love this shade for brides, like, um, or honestly, like anybody. I don't think they're coming out with this this collection again like I think they restocked it for the last time so maybe I'm not being super useful with this one but I love using this one on as a makeup artist just using it on people because it really really looks good on everybody and it's a nice matte color but it's a stunning color they may come back with it one day you never know with KKW Beauty so I really love their her bridal, her wedding collection, it was beautiful. So that's Flower Wall. I love that it's matte as well. Okay, so coming up, I think, I have like a tie for my favorite blush. There's two blushes. So this is the one of the tying ones. This is very graceful. I was so excited to get this. I think this was part of, oh yeah, it's KKW and Mario. I think this is where their blushes took a turn for the better, just formula-wise, because I felt this like wispy in the front of my face and you know when they just drive you nuts and anyway so <laughs> very graceful is one of my favorites the color it's the perfect blend of pink and peach together a little bit more peachy I would say on the skin and the formula and the pigment is just amazing so I'll show you a swatch of it it is so pigmented and so creamy and so it's just that pure matte and it's just adds so much color to the cheek it looks kind of like an apricot orange color but when you lightly dust that on the skin it just makes you look alive and pop so much so this is definitely one of my favorite blushes again they might not restock this one because it was a limited edition but like kkw like kkw beauty does they kind of bring restocks back every so often so you never really know can they have they kind of switched over to this packaging that's like cardboardish kind of packaging so i'm not sure why they did that but i like either way you get a lot more blush in these new blush palettes so love that do find their formula is always changing a bit it is always improving in my opinion so that's really exciting so the first blush i got out of this set was the classic pink so this one is tied with the very graceful i'm actually kind of thinking now this is my favorite this is my number one so this is classic pink which like at first, I'm not sure. I was more of a peach blush person, but now I'm a pink blush person. This blush duo is heavenly. So it is a bright pop of pink. This is matte and this is shimmer. 
So I love that there's so much product in here, first of all. This will last forever. I use it all the time. I love that you can just do matte if you want and you can just do shimmer. But I like to go in with a fluffy brush that I dip it in both and I apply it to the skin because I find it's the perfect balance. It gives you that pop of color, but kind of gives you that sheen in the skin that blends in with the with your highlight and just makes your skin look alive. So I find myself dipping in both. Unless I was just doing like a matte look specifically and I would just go here, but I'm getting excited about this blush because it's my favorite. Ooh, it's so creamy, you guys. It's so creamy. Like, you barely need any, and this just is like a gorgeous baby pink color. I love it with a passion. So I'll swatch both, obviously, here, um, so you can see them next to each other. This is the matte. This is the shimmer. Look how beautiful. Look at that pop of baby pink. Putting that little pop on your app, on the apple of your cheeks just makes everything look fun, youthful. This blush, if I recommend any blush out of KKW Beauty, it's this one. I will have this for me with me forever. I hope they never discontinue it. I'm obsessed with it. So I did get, oh, this is actually the most recent blush I've bought, but it's in the same family. I love that classic pink so much. I had to get the classic peach because I like peach blush as well. So I was like, I love that one. The formula, you got, you know what I'm getting at. So I'm wearing the peach today. I just got it and just started trying out. It's beautiful. Gives you that summery kind of sun-kissed glow because of that orange kind of bronzy color. That's the pan with the matte and the shimmer. And I'll go in and maybe I'll swatch this on my other arm. Creamy. KKW powders are supreme. They are the top notch powder situation. Like their eyeshadow palettes are my favorite. Their powders are my favorite. Everything. Like they just, I'm getting worked up. That's what usually happens. So look how beautiful this peach situation is. This is the matte, this is the shimmer. Rich, buttery, pigmented, pop of peachy, apricot goodness perfect color really combo for summertime because it blends into bronzers so well and makes you look bronzed and glowy love this color too but pink is my fave and then I got one blush from I do kind of want to try actually speaking of blushes I kind of want to try this hair little wisp is going to send me I want to try it. They had a honey and mauve collection separately and they each had a couple blushes. I got honey pot from the honey. I really wanted to try a blush. It's a beautiful color. I wonder, actually I'm going to swatch it. I think it's the darker of the two. I would, I want to say, I really want to try one of the mauve blushes because I, I have the mauve lip and just love it so much. So this honey blush, when I'm swatching it, it definitely is more deep compared to the peach. It's more like a deeper, it's like definitely more of a peachy bronzer color. So I don't wear this one tons and tons. I wouldn't say it's my favorite of the bunch. I really like the duos better. They're a little bit brighter. And I love the formula of this honey blush because their formulas are just so amazing. The color, I don't go for it all the time just because it's kind of a mix of a blush and bronzer, in my opinion, the colors. So if you're kind of a person who doesn't really like to wear both, this one would be amazing. But I always find myself going for those brighter colors like the classic pink or the classic peach. So that is my little breakdown and review of the KKW blushes that I have, the favorites that I have, ranking of them. I hope you found this useful. As always, make sure to check me out on Instagram at Hollywood Beauty. I post every single day about there, lots of makeup and fun, lots of makeup, skincare, hair, and make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube. I post every week with new beauty tutorial reviews for you guys. So as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time with another beauty video. I feel like I'm becoming your KKW Beauty girl, your KKW Beauty reviewer. Do you guys agree? Tell me in the comments.